Five, four, three, two, one. Uh, hi, I'm Ryan. I've been playing around with building, uh, building a device using an APR microcontroller that speaks USB. Uh, let's see. Can we push? There you go. Okay. So there's a free stack called VUSB available from a company called. Objective development. Uh, it's really nice. It doesn't take up a lot of space on there. Um, they have normally you have to pay a bunch of money for the USB forum to get a uh, vendor ID and a set of product IDs for your devices. Uh, they have one that's freely usable, which is great. Um, and they have support forms and a bunch of great examples. Here's a picture of the board, and that schematic constitutes the USB interface. It's, you know, a couple of Zener diodes and some resistors. Uh, anybody can assemble this. Um, the board I have, if you want to see later, is entirely through board components. Um, so if you want to build a custom device that speaks USB, uh, if you can use HID, do it. Um, Pretty much any common OS will speak USB HID. Um, the only problem is building report descriptors is a pain in the butt. Um, the USB forum has some tools for that. And then, you know, you, you still have to read through the spec and have some knowledge of it. But there are examples that you can use, so it's not too bad. Um, my device shows up as four joysticks, a mouse, and a keyboard. <laughs> So it, uh, what I've got is a device for hooking Super Nintendo controllers up to a computer via USB. Um, it's based on this Canadian guy's project for hooking up Nintendo and Super Nintendo controllers. I took his code, heavily modified it. Um, so I added support for the Super Nintendo multi-tap, which Bomberman uses, um, a few other things. And I added an emulation for keyboard and mouse. So Super Nintendo controller, it's acting as a mouse. I have joystick calibration program. Uh, um, you can see that, right? Okay. You're doing all this. So, it. yeah, Super Nintendo controller, it's acting as a joystick. Uh, I switch it back, press start, and then select. It uh, will show up as keyboard. Uh, hit X, turns into a mouse. Uh, let's see if I open up the text editor here. Uh, okay. <laughs> Macro support on there. <laughs> so, um, and then I did this, uh, which doesn't actually do anything yet, but we've got a menu here, the beginnings of one or changing settings in the firmware. So you can scroll through, it'll type out a menu for you, and basically pretend to be the, uh, a text terminal. Um, it's lots of fun. Uh, if you want to see more, talk to me after my talk's over, because I might be just about out of time. I think we can go a little bit longer, because we had some delays with the DNC. Uh, so no, I, um, not right now. Questions? <laughs> Questions? Well, Questions? Anyone? Can you plug in like a bunch of like more than two Super Nintendo controllers? Yeah, it's up to games? four. It's, it took up to a multi tap. Oh, can you all play games together? Yes, Bomberman. Right. Nice. <laughs> Bomberman was half the point of this. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. Okay. Awesome.